Welcome to the Ingalls Table. I'm Lindsay Moore and I'm going to share one of my favorite recipes with you today. My blog, Just a Little Organic, focuses on wellness, personal growth, style, and of course, food. Today, thanks to Ingalls, I'm going to show you how to cook my Lisbon steak and frites. Remember the full recipe and shopping list are at ingallstable.com. You can print it out or pull it up on your phone when you're at the store. Now let's get cooking. All right, we just got back from Ingalls and we're about to make my Lisbon Comfort Steak and Frites. And really all this is is steak and french fries, but they called them frites in Portugal. I don't know if it's Portuguese, but um, it sounds fancier. So what I've got one bag of Alexa crinkle cut fries. Let me just dump them all out. The oven's preheated to 400. Spread them all out evenly and on a baking sheet and then I'll pop them in. Okay, the frites are in the oven and we'll go ahead and do the steak. I've got fajita steak and you can buy this pre-cut in, um, in the meat department. And this is about a pound, maybe a pound and a half and it should be good for four to five people. And before I put, before I put them in the pan, I like to do a little bit of olive oil, maybe like a tablespoon or so. I've got kosher salt here, about a teaspoon, and then some fresh cracked pepper. Now this is really all this needs because we're gonna put this really yummy sauce on the top later. So you don't need that much flavor or different flavor from the steak besides the steak itself. And our pan's heated over medium, medium high, and I'm gonna put a, about a tablespoon of oil. Let this warm up just a little bit, it shouldn't take too long. We're gonna cook about half of an onion, and three cloves of garlic minced. We're just gonna cook until the onion is translucent and the garlic starts to become fragrant. You don't want to burn it. And then try to spread the steak out evenly onto the pan as best you can. And this will take about five to seven minutes, not that long. All right, since our steak is about done, we're gonna go ahead and put half the cilantro in and give it a stir, and our frites are still cooking. All right, we'll let the frites finish up in the oven and we'll be right back to plate it up. All right, fries are done and out of the oven, and now I'm gonna show you how to plate it up. We've got two bowls or plates here and fill them with french fries. Grab a few slices of steak and just put them right on top. This is exactly how they did it in Lisbon and it was delicious. And then we're gonna garnish with a little bit of cilantro. And then the final touch is this really good shrimp sauce that you can get in the refrigerated section. Um, it is really good on all kinds of things, but especially steak and french fries. So just drizzle a little bit on top and voila! That's it for our steak and frites. Thanks for joining me here at the Ingalls Table. Remember, you can find more recipes, videos, tips, and tricks at ingallstable.com. Until next time, I'll see you online.